morning guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Kamikaze and welcome to the version 8.4 uh, newest video. So I wanted to make this video because there was an update out on this version that um, kind of made me want to play the uh, my secondary account again. And the reason for that is uh, because of the auto feature uh, thing that just came out on this version. So let's dive into the uh, 8.4 <laughs> update read more file and on the first thing that you guys can see here so three things came out on this version and uh, one of them is not displayed here but uh, I'm gonna talk about that later on so the first one is the treasure bazaar so the treasure bazaar is something that came out uh, it's not out yet it's gonna be out when the uh, treasure map um, activates again and the treasure bazaar 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 <laughs> works the same way as the uh, railway shop or the uh, bazaar that we have right now so instead of trading in units for points uh, you're gonna trade in tickets that you get from playing the treasure map so those tickets will be available uh, starting on the next treasure map and hopefully every single treasure map after that and you can trade in tickets for past uh, treasure map uh, units that you didn't collect extra copies of that unit and um, women break materials for any treasure map unit that's uh, been out um, on the global version so things that you missed out or you didn't play the certain treasure map you can get the uh, units with tickets you can get the memory break materials obviously it's going to require a lot of tickets sorry I actually don't know um, how many points it requires to get a certain unit or the materials um, but I know it's kind of a lot I don't know exactly the exact the number but it have, I mean I think it requires a lot of a lot of points to get the uh, 50 copies and the full um, materials to max uh, wimp break the uh, the character but I mean it's something that uh, is very helpful and um, allows players that didn't play a certain treasure map or uh, didn't play for the entirety of the treasure map and missed out on a couple of things to get their hands on uh, whatever they missed so that's the first part of the update so the second part and the uh, I think biggest update that um, Tur Turkey Cruise had for a very long time when it comes to uh, game changing updates is the auto tap feature so I, got, I don't I, I don't know if you guys remember uh, like two months three months ago there was an inquiry where they asked the question about what we uh, think we should uh, they should implement on the game or they think we would be cool to have in the game and the auto tap feature was one of them so I my, myself I did I did that <laughs> I uh, chose this option because I mean Instead of going for Fortnite and all that, they implemented this right now, at least for story mode only. And the reason why they did that is because um, people would exploit this um, a lot, and that that can kind of uh, could kill the game a little bit, could make it a lot easier and too easy uh, in some uh, in some cases. And uh, making it only for story mode is the uh, main thing that players wanted this anyway. So. In my talking about my, about my experience, I in this account that I have right now, um, I'm I think in Rainbase. Let me check. And um, it just yeah, it's just too boring for me to play, to be honest. Because the team I have, uh, it's a Gear Four Woofy team, and um, I mean I don't really need to eat perfects, and it's super boring to play. And I wanted to clear the story mode island as soon as possible for the Anisugo, and I just don't have the motivation. Motivation and time because a lot of things came on, exams and all that. So, um, but with this update, it re it allows me to do <laughs> to qu basically clear the story mode by itself. So let me clear this uh, stage right here, so I can show you uh, how this works. And um, the uh, the algorithm for this feature is the mid 95% of the time you're gonna be hitting a crate and occasionally you can hit a good or a perfect so teams that require you to have a perfect uh, chain they're not gonna work <laughs> and uh, teams that require you to have a good grade and perfect chain is not gonna work either so uh, take that in mind so if you guys click on this little button that says auto right here on top you go in auto mode so as you guys can see I'm not playing and uh, the game is going on so as you guys can see and as I said you're gonna he grades most of the time, uh, perfect occasionally right there, and uh, good uh, will appear often. Uh, one of the issues that didn't happen there, but can happen in the 
in some ways is the uh, fact that you will not kill uh, boosters or evolvers um, on a single tap because if you hit a great or a good uh, if you don't have a matching orb they will not die so take that in mind as well and uh, basically you don't have to do anything if you want to stop the auto the um, the auto uh, play you just click on the bottom part here so anywhere on the screen where the characters are the uh, bottom half you click on there and it stops and then you can do it again and uh, for example if you want to like it's a, it's a stage where you need to hit perfect or you need to activate specials you stop it and then uh, you continue with the other play cutscenes and all that like characters talking and uh, specials that you want to clear out you can click on the top on the top right here on the top half of the screen and it's not gonna stop the other play so stopping the other play is only on the uh, bottom half so the top half is for you to clear uh, dialogues and uh, cutscenes so I stopped the finger I'm gonna do it again and uh, we're gonna clear the stage very easy so there's a good see the 95 percent of the time is gonna be a great so uh, when building teams consider that because it can be annoying can be um, can turn out into a failure sometimes and there we go stage square so amazing <laughs> I, I love this update um, and as I said I'm gonna continue playing this account right now I was I, I kind of like I stopped playing knowing that this update would come eventually because it was leaked a while back um, but right now I can say that I'm gonna clear these arm modes before the uh, the anniversary so the last update that I'm gonna talk about and I don't have uh, I don't have the uh, like the uh, the thing to show you because it requires me to create a new account and I can't um, but basically the the update is instead of so prior to this update you would get 50 gems when uh, downloading the game when you create a new account for the 500 taps and uh, you would get 50 gems when you get to the game do a multiple and those were the uh, the star characters that you would have for your account that uh, allowed rerolls to happen because the way it works is there's programs where you don't have to do the tutorial and if you're not happy with the uh, multiple that you did that you did uh, the program allows you to repeat that jump the tutorial get the 50 gems back do another multiple and so on they got rid of that so now when you create an account instead of getting 50 gems you get five gems only and you get um, a mail where you have 10 tries on a sugar fest it's not a Suga Fest, so for example, let's say that the uh, past Suga Fest that was the uh, White Beer and Marco Suga Fest, if it's the the Suga, if the Suga Fest is on, you will not have the chance of pulling White Beer and Marco, because those ten pulls that you have are exclusive for Straw Hat units. So you can only get Straw Hats from these ten pulls. This includes Legends. This includes every single Straw Hat that came out in the game, Fortnite, Story Mode, Rare Recruits, whatever. Are all in there and legend, so you can get a good, you can get uh, legend Nami, you can get Gear Four V Two Luffy, um, you can get Time Skip Luffy, you can get Zoro, you can get Nico Robin, you can get Frankie, and so on. If you are not happy with the ten pulls that you did, you can erase those pulls and try again. So basically, you can try again as many times as you want um, until you get the uh, the ten uh, units that you are satisfied with. So if you have time, you can sit there, <laughs> try to. I don't know, what, hundreds of of multiples and just wait for the, uh, the character that you want. So, if you're, for example, if you're after Gear 4 V2 Luffy, you can stay there until you get one. Um, I've seen people pull and people try it out and the uh, legend rate isn't that good, so it might be there for a while, but, you know, it can happen. Um, so, yeah, that was the last part of the update. Um, I mean, it's not big, but in terms of game-changing updates, this is one of the biggest, in my opinion. Um, yeah, that's basically about it so if you guys enjoyed the video like the video give it a subscribe comment down below if you guys uh, want to know something or create it on the video put it on my channel and uh, yeah I'll see you guys in the next video peace